You know, these active drills are always interesting, but we learned that this one in particular, this session, comes days after the relative of a student pointed a loaded gun at another kid. And had it not been for a fast thinking security guard, this might have been a nightmare situation. Person came up with a loaded weapon, staff was in jeopardy and kids. We're going to do lockdown, barricade, counter. This is now required learning, active shooter training for all staff members at Dawn High School. Any day, any time. So, you know, you can't depend on always police or security. You have to be in position to know what to do if an active shooter is in your place of business, school, or in the community. It's only a drill now, but what pumped the adrenaline today was the fact this school was recently put on lockdown when an adult relative of a student brought a loaded gun on campus, threatening to hurt someone. The head of security says the training can mean the difference between life or death. I am a big advocate for this. Uh, this one of the things I don't want to do is see any more students or young people dying due to gun violence. Charles McGee stood down a person with a gun on campus. It was training and instinct that prevented a situation from going from bad to worse. I said it's my duty to talk to him and let him know and reassure him that your kid is in our best interest. And when, they, when I came face to face with that, that gun situation, that conversation he thought about because it was a kid behind me that was possibly getting hurt. Could have went, it could have, it could have went south quick, but at the end of the day, you know, like I said, the, the, the training that we receive here uh, and the positions that we're in, it's critical. Thank God that we all sitting here and, and it's a story instead of a, 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 a funeral. Yeah, thank God, huh? I'm told this situation with the gun actually happened after students got into a fight and one of the kids sent a text. This all began again when a student sent this text to a relative about the altercation. The active shooter drills will continue over there until all staff members complete the training. I'm Curtis Fuller, WLWT.